Hello, welcome to this video of biology. I will be explaining how you can write properly the genetic diagram. I'm not going to draw, but I'll be drawing, I'll be showing you certain combinations, certain arrows, how you can come up with them. So I'll look at certain diseases like hemophilia, all right? The, the color brightness and many more. So let's start from hemophilia. The, what, what you need to know about hemophilia is hemophilia hemophilia is a, a genetic disease all right one what, what must know that is a genetic what disease let's call it a disorder this what type of genetic disorder is this is, is excess breeding okay you are bleeding without without stopping what causes this it's because it's lack of clotting factors clotting factors such as vitamin K each vitamin K Vitamin K, that's philoquinone. Then, hemophilia can lead to death. It's a fatal disease, it's a genetic disease, excess. Now, it is also found on the X chromosome only. Now this one now I'm going to explain. A female, then male. We know that the alleles or the genes for female are X, X. For male, it's X and Y. Okay? So, for hemophilia, let's talk of a normal parent, okay? Let's say these are normal. Let me just erase this. Let me start over. So let's say normal. Normal parents. For normal parents under hemophilia, a female is going to be like this. Anyway, the symbol for hemophilia is H or small letter H. So for a normal parent, female should be like this. Or male will be like this. Remember what I talked about? It's only on the X chromosome. Normal. Alright? Then carrier. Carrier but normal. Parent. These are normal. Now, these are what we call carrier, but they are normal. Or they are normal, but they are carriers. For female, it's like this. Why is it like this? Let me just explain something. It's, it's, this is called the carrier because the H, it has shielded the small letter H. It's more like it's covering this. It's like you have a big bar here, and now there's like a bar here, small. What happens? This who can if a person is standing here, can you see what is this side? No, because it's been what shielded by this. So it's just like you are just carrying this. This bar is just carrying this, but it cannot be seen. It's like when you go for HIV testing. This day you go, they know they say no, there's no disease. After two months you go, they find it. Why? Because at that particular time you are just a carrier. You can display the effect. You can display it. So. That is what uh, it means by being a carrier. You are carrying, but you are not sick. Males are never carriers. I repeat. Males are never carriers. So there's no carrier for a man. And sick, or we can call them hemophilic parents. Hemophilic parents is now small letter H. 
That's female. That's male. So this is how you can come up with alleles for hemophilia. Normal parent is this, female, male. It's only in a female where we have carriers and it's denoted by this. In male, we, are, we have no carriers. While well, we have those which, which you call sick or hemophilic and they are represented by this. For female, use this. For male, use those symbols. Thank you so much.